two one year deals, obviously the huge injuries, and now you've got a, a multi year deal, another reinvestment from the same team. What's that been like? Uh, it's, I mean, it's, it's been a journey. I would say that. Uh, I'm grateful for it. Uh, I mean, I'm, I don't know. I, don't, I can't really explain everything that's, that I feel right now. Uh, but I can tell you, before I signed the deal, I, I mean, I still feel almost the same. You know, I mean, the deal, it, I mean, it, it definitely brings a little more security to my life, I guess. But as far as like everything else goes, uh, I'm still, I'm still the same type one. I'm still happy. You know, I'm just grateful. Did you have some options to go elsewhere, and why did you decide to be back here? Yeah, I mean, it was, yeah, it was stressful. I would say that. Uh, I mean, but uh, it, it was, it was, it was tough to turn down some of those options. Uh, mm -hmm. But um, I mean, Chris and them made it easy. You know, so I mean, it. it came down to like just where where is it that you want to like position yourself like as far as like when you're done playing and like the relationships you have with these people you know it, Indy's a special place this organization is like really really special to me uh, especially like the front office uh, the cafeteria staff everyone the media like just the entire building so I mean I'm forever grateful for them I mean, what did last season mean to you to make it through the entire year? Obviously, playing a fourth goal, coming off the two injuries. Oh, I mean, I mean, I, I never go into it thinking like, you know, uh, I gotta, I gotta do this to overcome a hump or anything. It's just my mind is I, I approach the season as I normally would, and you know, I mean, to make it 17 games was was amazing. You know, but I don't set out to go nine games or nothing like that, like I did previously. But I mean, it, it was it was great to get it done. That guy, how much have you grown as a person, a player through all this? Uh, I, I, I guess you could say I, I grew tremendously uh, through my patience, just patience. But other than that, uh, I just I kept the same message the whole time. So. I mean, that, that was the main thing, just growing through the message. People, people always want um, big name signings and all that. Right. Um, but, I mean, you guys re-signed a lot of good players from a team that won nine games. Can you guys take the next step with mostly the same guys in that locker room, do you feel like, next year? Most definitely. Uh, you know, I can see if we, like, didn't have good players here or, like, if, if it was, like, a bad group of guys. But, the guys we re-signed and extended, uh, I mean, those are some of the best young men, like some of us will ever meet in our lives. Uh, you know, uh, I can't really explain like how grateful I am for them as teammates. Uh, I think all of us have been teammates for six years almost, so six, six or seven years. So, uh, I mean, just just the core group of guys on the defense and everybody else. I mean, it's it's just. Wonderful to see because we all know, like, you know, we're in our primes. Like, it, you just have to take that next step. So I feel like that's demanding of us, like, as players too. And for you, um, the last couple off seasons have been hard, right? Because because yeah. those injuries. Yeah. How different will it be to go into this season feeling good and got a new contract, feeling good? Right. How different is it? I would say uh, the main thing is I get to train you know, a little better, you know, than before. Cause like around this time, I was probably still like doing strength work. Like now it's, I could do more stuff, like work on like techniques that I probably couldn't do before. Or I had to like work on it little by little, you know, things that I feel like I could clean up to add to my game. Just, just different stuff like nicks and nacks to like the timeline of when I had the injury versus now. You, you kind of touched on this earlier, but what, what does it mean to have been in Indianapolis your whole career, playing for you know so far, playing for one team, and then sign this deal? Like you're starting to get up there into like the, yeah. the length that most people don't get with one team. Yeah, I know. Uh, I think I, that was one of the biggest things uh, that I, I approached like life about. Like I was like, if I like 
commit m myself to something, and I wanted like be with just one team. Like you know, even in college, like I remember when times got hard in college. Uh, you know, and like a lot of coaches would leave or something like that, and they'll reach out and they'll be like, "Hey, like you could transfer here or something like that." And I, that, that's just never been my mo. So I just, you know, I I just stayed the course and. And then, like when I got drafted at Indy, it was just, it was like, listen, like whatever it is that this organization needs of me, you know, they gave me an opportunity, and they gave me several opportunities. Actually, I was like, you know, this is the place that I should be. You mentioned a little stressful free agency. Was there ever a thought that you maybe wouldn't be back here? I mean, the the thought of it was there, but I mean, it, it went away. So. <laughs> I mean, but I mean, I I was just like in my mind, I was prepared for like just a solid free agency uh, and circuit or whatever. And then I was like, you know, ultimately, I this is where I wanted to be. So I was grateful for that. Maybe you had opportunities to go somewhere where you could maybe play more snaps. That you know, obviously, there's a lot of good players here. Right. Like, do you feel kind of? I don't know, like at home, it, just to fit the system here, did that, did that factor in? Uh, each and every day, I feel like it's challenging. Uh, it wasn't about, like, the snaps or nothing. It was just about, like, just where I feel, like, not necessarily grounded, but, like, the opportunity here is, like, still, like, right in front of me. Everything, each and every day is a competitive day in my eyes. So, you know, that's what I bring to the game of football. You know, I'm a competitive person. Uh, I challenge you, everyone around me. I don't care if it, what position you play. It doesn't like none of that never like mattered to me. Like I'm just here to like get everyone around me better. Uh, so you know, snaps. You, you. I mean, it's a lot of people that play limited snaps, but they're still phenomenal players. So I just feel like you know what I do with those snaps. You know, is is all on me. I have to take advantage of it.